I gotta tell you, you have like a Congo line full of dead people behind you. Like no. so many people that are guiding you and that are there for you. I believe that. First of all, your grandmother passed. I thought this was your mother. She's so strong around you. Did she help raise you when yes, you were younger? Yes, and she used to say, keep an eye on that one because she's different. She used she to knew. say that all the time. She told me from when you were younger, like you just, you, you took on responsibility yourself. Like she told me that you were like the woman of the house from when, I want to say like you were four years old. Yeah. Because she showed me visions of like you going and like putting dishes in the sink and doing I the did. dishes. I did. I cooked. I did all she the dishes. Me. I cleaned. I did everything. Because she loved that about you. She tells me you used to have girl time in the kitchen with her and sit yes, at, the, at the counter with I her. Yes, I loved cooking with my grandmother. But what the, she, but she, she used to sing as well. Well, because yes. we're connected. She's singing Alleluia to me when I'm connecting with her. She used to sing in the church. Absolutely. I see so much of her in you. Oh. Like, she literally felt, she's telling me that one of the greatest things in her life was being able to help raise you because she felt that you were like a daughter to her. And she tells me that you still talk to her in your head and talk to her at any time. She goes, and I want you to know that I'm right there. My head is spinning right now because I, I love her so much. Your grandmother always knew that you are going to go far. She didn't know you were going to be doing this, but she thought you were going to be like an actress or a singer or whatever because she mm -hmm. says to me that you were always in the spotlight and she always pushed that towards you. Mm -hmm. When everybody else would tell me to sit down, she'd say, let her sing, let her perform. Yeah, wow. I gotta tell you, one of the other things, Savage, this woman, your grandmother is so funny because she's like, talk about this, talk about this, talk about this. And she said to me, the one thing that she wants you to know is about how proud she is of you. She says that you were always her little girl. She says, and you allowed me to be a mother all over again. She says, and seeing how far you've cr come, she says, what I'm so proud is that you remind me so much of myself. She said, because you did this all on your own. She said, and I want to let you know that I'm the one who's guiding you. I'm the one who's there and I'm with you every single day. She says, so I don't want you to stress, but to know that I'm there. Thank you. She just said to me, happy birthday. Whose birthday is it? Mine. She said she wants to let you know she's going to be with you on your birthday. Thank you. She says, she says, and the one thing that she doesn't want, want you to be upset about is about when she passed here in this world, because there was an issue of you getting to her or getting to see her. She says, I did not want her to see me like that. Do you understand that? I was in um, Europe modeling, I think, at the time, and I couldn't. Your grandmother said, listen, she goes, I wanted you to do one thing. She says, focus on you, focus on your goals, focus on your dreams and your career. How do you live with him? Is he crazy? <laughs> <laughs> you might want to trade him in <laughs> later. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. Thank One you for being me here. to work with her, but thank you also for what you just told me. Oh, thank you.